हेलो ऑल वेलकम बैक टू अनकॉमन गिग्स माय नेम इज वसंत आई होप यू ऑल डूइंग वेल इन केस इफ यू आर सी मी फर्स्ट टाइम ऑन द इंटरनेट आई एम अ कंटेंट क्रिएटर आई हेल्प पीपल टू क्लियर दर इंटरव्यू आई मेक बोथ टेक्निकल एंड नॉन टेक्निकल नॉन टेक्निकल कंटेंट ऑन द इंटरव्यू प्रिपरेशन ऑफ द फ्रंट एंड टेक्नोलॉजीज सो इफ यू आर समन सीरियस यू प्रिपेयर फॉर द इंटरव्यू प्लीज गोड एंड चेक दउट लिंक टू सीरियस डी सेवन ऑन द स्क्रीन आल्स इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन सेक्शन नाउ विदाउट वेस्टिंग फॉर दट टाइम लेट्स के स्टार्ट विद द टॉपिक ऑफ द डे थ्री वेबसाइट्स so three websites that every front end developer especially react js developer should know okay that's what the kind of the video the video is going to be less than 5 minutes so please watch the video till the end so these are the website that i constantly refer to make my front end content so that if you're someone content creator or if you're someone who want to grow in the front end tech watching this uh, reading this websites every day will be very very helpful for you so which is the first website that is react.dev it's official website of the react js wasn't Why you are showing the official website? We already know the official website exists. See earlier, the official website of React uh, was not that good, frankly, because there are a lot of things that was not clearly explained. Even for a simple example of a hook, used to go, you you are supposed to go outside from from blocks and used to refer. But with the new uh, uh, new particular new website of the React dot dev, actually it was beta dot React dot dev. Now it has become React dot dev. Okay, so. where i mean i think they have solved all the minor glitches that have they had now it's totally a new website where you can refer to okay so this particular website has so much of content not just to learn react but also to learn javascript lot of concepts of javascript and every aspect of react is explained in depth okay like how a particular state is updated how a, a react component will get to know what to return and when to return so and how object nesting happens so lot of concepts are explained in depth So for example if you go like some some random stuff you take like state a component's memory okay so here they explain what is state and then if you go down little bit little what is the pitfall what is the mistake the developers are usually doing then they add some additional note okay and then if you come down how does react know which state to return see like additional reading to master one small topic there are lot of additional reading okay then there is a recap then there is some challenges So now, frankly speaking, to learn React, if you are someone who understand in English well and interested in reading, you don't need any other source. Just come to official documentation and read the documentation in depth. You will be able to learn React completely. So this is my first suggestion. What is the second website that I recommend? Okay. So second website that I recommend is. So common website and one of my favorite website that I always go and read about learning JavaScript is Dev. To. Okay. what you do is come to google just search dev.to and javascript okay and then you will be a new link you can open and you can bookmark that okay and dev.to react so these are the both beautiful particular actually dev.to is a website these are the particular links inside that to get to know the lot of concepts of javascript and react so a lot of people come here and write their articles okay so what nobody told about software design building robust serverless messaging service with amazon event bridge pipeline and cdk layout multi host broadcast with amazon ivs so there are lot of concepts of javascript that you can learn from this okay second thing lot of react concepts also you can learn by going to this okay creating custom radio button react just step by step guide okay clock app using github actions automate your ci cd in react so will everything be useful for you no definitely no because these are something that has by particular expert has written it it may be useful for you or it may not be but coming here checking every day make it a habit come to this website every day and spend 10 15 minutes read one or two articles so the way you look at each problem will change okay you may know like the way how to share the data between two two per two websites is two components or two containers is just using the redux but there are tens and diff- tens different ways with which you can share data between two components so if you come here and read actively such concepts you will get to know and you can add them while you are code reviewing or you can share the information with your friends okay now what is the third website and favorite website of mine is free code camp okay i think most of you might already know again you can go to free code camp open free code camp and just go to search and search for react okay same way you can do go there and search for javascript okay and you can bookmark them and keep first time i'm just showing you such a way like if you're going for first time how you need to do okay every day come here see he is t- today's article i think it is in may 20th this video also recorded on may 20th only so may 20th 2023 how to use react server component a beginner guide state management react props sources context api 
so there are a lot of experts out in this this forums so will be constantly writing about this thing so you go ahead and read so your perspective about everything will change by keeping this habit of reading okay then you can also get a lot of information about javascript here how to create interactive heat map using javascript how javascript asynchronous operation work in browser how to use sort function in js so some you might already know you can skip them some which you don't know please read them so this is the first thing that is you become a better developer by following three websites regularly okay what is the other advantage say another advantage is you have to become a brand so you have to people should know like by looking at your profile in social media you know lot of things how you can do whatever you read here start writing in medium or start writing in linkedin article and then keep posting it in your linkedin or any other social media that you want to become popular so people start thinking if you are constantly writing about these things you know something when you start constantly writing about these things then you start reading more and more then you start writing some content that is not written by anyone else like you are the someone who has actually figured it out and writing okay so like this you can start your content creation journey also by reading actively or if you are not interested in content creation at least you become an expert in whatever the domain you are so these are the three website i'm summarizing first is react.dev second one is free code camp third one is dev.to so these are three top three website that i would recommend for every front end developer and react js developer to watch uh, go and read every day so there are other three websites or other lot of other websites also which you can refer to if you're interested please mention that in the comment section i'll be more than happy to make more such websites from where you can learn front end development thank you so much for watching if you like the content please like the video and share the video with your friends so that they also can get benefited comment whatever you felt so far and subscribe to my channel uncommon guys is a humble request i have a simple motto of helping lot of people to clear their interview if you can subscribe to my channel i can reach that goal very early okay thank you so much catch you in next video